Robbie Ray, you can see what he did last year. 500 record, 371 ERA. That's over 32 starts. 189 innings, 212 strikeouts. So he still is able to pump some people out after leaving the league a couple of years ago. 3-2 to Quan again. Swing and a miss, he got him. Good breaking ball, one down. So one out for the Guardians, and here is shortstop Ahmed Rosario. The 1-2 pitch, swing and a fly ball into right center field. Julio going back to the warning track, circles underneath. He's there and makes the catch, and there's two outs for the Guardians. Back-to-back four-pitch walks. Ramirez to second, Bell to first. And swing and a miss. Good rally. Got two quick outs, labored through two batters, walking them, and then gets a strike at the end. Hunter Gaddis will be making the start for the uh, Guardians today. Make two starts last year. And you can see his numbers at Akron and Columbus. This is a big guy. He was going to make the team in the bullpen. He's getting the start because Tristan McKenzie hurt himself, uh, came out of the ball game in his last start in Arizona. Julio to lead things off. I have a pretty good chance. This one hit the opposite way. Down the line. It is off the fence. Julio digging for two. He's going to have to hurry. And the throws offline. He's in with a leadoff double. First hit of the season for Julio, who went 0 for 4 last night. Colton, one of the newcomers on this ball club. Colton 0 for 3 last night. Looking for his first Mariner hit. That's going to play the run. Julio coming around third. Manny waving him, then a late stop side that scores standing up. The throw from Gonzalez was not even close. one nothing Mariners. First hit and RBI for Colton Wong. Hunter Gaddis was just charged with a ball by home plate umpire Jordan Baker. The pitch clock had expired. Right field. Gonzalez with a routine play. One away. There goes Wong. Raleigh pops it up on the infield. Jose Ramirez is there, and the side is retired. Seattle strikes first. They lead 1-0 after an inning. The 3-0 pitch. Ball four. He missed high. And that is the third four-pitch walk of the night as the Guardians have loaded up the bases with nobody out here in the second. And Miles Straw, the right-handed hitting center fielder, coming to the plate. Bases loaded, nobody out. Here's a pop into foul territory. Hernandez comes back into fair ground and makes the catch. A horrible throw, and look at Oscar Gonzalez aggressively scoring. And it coming around third is Jimenez. The ball went to the dugout. He scores two. The Guardians lead it 2-1, to one. and all the way to third base went Mike Zanino. Those are the run-and-gun Guardians we saw a year ago. Hernandez threw to the plate, but it got by everyone and was backed up in foul ground third base side by Robbie Ray. He made an errant throw to the plate with Jimenez scoring from second on a head first slide. And it got Zanino in the oh, back as he was going. Here's Stephen Kwan infield in the pitch. And now Kwan to right field. That's deep. And a nice catch in the gap by Teoscar Hernandez. But Zanino tags and scores, and it's 3 to 1 Cleveland. If Cal Raleigh can be a difference maker here. Tyan runs aboard in scoring position. And puts a bullet into that gap. That'll tie it up. Cal Raleigh, stand up, two run devil, ties this baby at 3 3 in the third. Boy, Cal, man, he heated that thing up. So it is second and third with one away. Base hit, you can get a pair. Shoots it toward left. Fair oh, ball. Oh, baby. Jimenez will score and straws right on his heels. On his way to second, Quan is in there with a two-run double, and he'll hold at second base when the ball gets away. Did you see where Straw was? He was, I mean, high kicking it. He read that that ball was going to be over the glove of uh, Suarez, and I mean, he was right on the tail. But now Josh Bell's in the hole, 0-2. Comebacker ends the inning. The Guardians regain the lead. 5-3 Cleveland. Here's Julio Rodriguez. Hummel on at second. The 2-0 pitch to Julio. Swinging a line shot deep to left field. Juan twisting, turning. Off his glove. He falls down. The ball rolls to the wall. Here comes Hummel running third. He'll score. 
Julio Rodriguez in its second with an RBI double. Julio with his second double of the night and his first RBI of the season. It's now Cleveland 5 and the Mariners 4. Now the Guardians have the bases loaded with one away. The pitch on the way. Swinging a one-hopper to short. Charging his Crawford. He'll come home to the plate for one and they will get the force at home on Josh Naylor. Nice play by J.P. Crawford. A one-hopper to short. And now it's back to the top of the lineup for Stephen Kwan. Now he's up there again with the bases loaded. Look Line at this. Line base hit left field. He made his scores. Here comes Zanino. And the throw to the plate is cut off. What a night for Quan. Stephen Quan has knocked in five runs on the night. Two more here in the fifth inning. Murphy did not deliver a pitch quickly enough after warming up. And a pitch clock violation is called on Murphy. It's 1-0. and oh. Runners at first and second. Here's the 2-1. Swung on, ground ball near the middle, on through, base hit, left center. On his way home is Straw, he'll score. Into third goes Quan, and aboard at first with an RBI single. Ahmed Rosario, and it is now 8-4 Cleveland. So now the top of the order comes up with two men aboard. And Julio Rodriguez, the last guy you wanted to face this inning, coming to the plate. Swing and a miss. Wicked changeup. And Morgan gets out of it, striking out Rodriguez and striking out the side. Stephen Kwan has a chance to have a career night in RBIs. He's already matched his career best of five. A little chopper back to the mound. Flexen takes his out at first. Zanino to third. Straw down to second. One down in the seventh. Seattle will have to bring the infield in. And here comes Ahmed Rosario to the plate. The next pitch. Swing it. It's a fly ball into right field. There's only one out. Zanino's getting ready to run. Teoscar Hernandez makes the catch. Zanino's coming home. Here's the throw. It's up the line. It's received by Cal. He puts the tag on Zanino for out number three. Teoscar Hernandez setting sights on home plate from right field. It's again the top of the seventh. De Los Santos, the runner held at first. He's ready. Here it comes. Swung on, hit back to the mound. Somehow it was grabbed by De Los Santos. He kind of surprised himself. Then a little over underhand flip to first to get Raleigh. And we have played seven. Jose Ramirez is 0 for 3 with a walk. Swing and a line drive. This is hit to deep right center field. This ball is going to be off the wall. And it's a leadoff double. In standing at second is Jose Ramirez, his second double of the year. Infield in, Josh Naylor lines a base hit to left center. That'll knock in Ramirez, and the Guardians now lead it 9-4. to four. A heads-up base running by Jose Ramirez, and then Josh Naylor with his second hit of the night and his first RBI of the campaign. Walk or an air. The one-two pitch. Swing, a little looper into shallow right field. Hernandez coming in, slides, and he makes the catch. Teoscar Hernandez hustling in, goes into that slide, comes up with it. Two outs for the Guardians here in the top of the eighth inning. Emmanuel Classe on the pitch for Cleveland. Obviously, this is not a save situation. Struck oh. him out looking. I'll tell you what. The leadoff man, Julio Rodriguez. Struck him out. First two have just been overmatched. 1-1 one, one pitch. Swing and a little weak pop-up. Into shallow left. Jose Ramirez is there. Makes the catch. Ball game. And win number one in 2023. 